the community Christmas tree is now lit at Chico City Plaza. Action News Now reporter Ryan Ketchum was at the ceremony and spoke with community members about what this event means for them. Hundreds of people gathered right here at 6 o'clock tonight for the 43rd annual lighting of the community Christmas tree, which included several choral and dance performances. It was so beautiful. It was so nice. It felt like Chico was back together, community again. It's just nice seeing like your neighbors, people that you share space with, and everyone was so happy. I feel like the energy was just contagious and nice and kind and I don't know. It was it was fun. This event was not held in person last year due to the COVID-19 pandemic. Fantastic. It's fantastic. I mean, we've been waiting for this to kind of kick off. We always come down here every year and we're really excited that everybody's coming out in person this year and uh, just get to be part of the community again, you know, with the restrictions lifted a little bit more and uh, we're, we're excited about it. Several local businesses have seen the impact of this event and many others held in downtown Chico as people have been shopping local. I can tell that when things go on downtown, it just brings people out, right? It gets people in front of your doors. It makes people want to do things outside of their house. And I think it also makes people comfortable to like come out and be around each other. And so my business always does better when Chico has more things going on locally. So I love it. I love it. I'm thankful for it in lots of ways. <laughs> All these ice skaters behind me were able to enjoy skating underneath the Christmas tree lights for the first time here in Chico. Reporting in City Plaza, I'm Ryan Ketchum. Action News Now, coverage you can count on. Our very own court clopping, by the way, helped emcee the event tonight at City Plaza.